Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video I take you along on a short adventure ride outside of Pasco, Washington. Gotta love this stuff. Smith Canyon, Juniper Dunes. Look at that. What kind of good night. It's a city down here. I see lots of people. Where are all the... I don't see any bikes. Yeah, I guess they're all four-wheelers and side-by-sides. <laughs> yeah. That, that young guy, he's... He's, he's, he's the boss right there. How about that? It's Levy Park down there. Unfortunately, it's closed. I don't know why they couldn't keep it open. Got it. I can remember it couple years ago coming down here it's just a nice park and I think it was a state park but I'm not certain but you'd think they could let some private party take it over and then this hiking trail is on the old railroad bed This hiking trail right here goes almost clear across the, uh, the state, goes clear to Spokane, then back to Pasco. It's it's enormous. But this is one of my favorites. This is just gorgeous. There's just a little ways out of Tri Cities. It's a little. should park up here and walk into this park and see what's left of it. Pretty steep. Sixty three degrees. There's some folks out here boating. Ice Harbor. They're fishing right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Doing any good? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a pretty cool spot along Snake River. 
Let's go gravel road. Right down here just off the water. Blue Ice Harbor Dam is pretty cool. I like it down here. So this is Trailhead Park. Trailhead Park is a treasure of the Tri-Cities. This is in uh, South Richland. And here, it's a, it's a nice park, but the highlight of this place is the hiking trails. It's, it's uh, reportedly one of the most traversed hiking trails in the state of Washington. This trail goes to the top of the mountain there, and on the skyline, I can see it. You probably can't on this camera, but there you see people at the skyline here. But if you take the, uh, the, the path right there, take this path and if you take the long way around to the left it's two miles to the top with 850 feet of elevation and it's, by the time you get up there and back it's four miles 850 feet and it's a, it's a it's an hour a little more and just a wonderful workout very popular in this community This is what they call the west entrance uh, to Badger Mountain Preserve. It's the uh, it's the west trailhead. People, we always just call it the backside, but still, you go up here. It doesn't look like much, but it's actually you go up from here. It's the same 850 foot of elevation gain. You can't see the top from here. This is a false summit, but you go up here and. It's, it's, uh, you immediately go into some fairly steep trail that gets your heart rate up in a hurry. Again, this is a very popular, it's the other side of Badger Mountain and, uh, and, and extremely, uh, very, very popular hiking area. Uh, great for fitness and hiked it many, many times. That right there is Candy Mountain. This one's kind of neat because the trail starts out gentle and the further you go the steeper it gets and it gives you a chance to warm up before you go right into heavy, um, I mean a, a steeper trail so it's all very well supported, well done um, trail and uh, from there the views are phenomenal um, Goose Ridge to the what is that to the west and Richland to the east and north and it's just a uh, just wonderful trail I like coming here a lot ah oh, for heaven's sakes there we go Yeah, those, those are entitled to geese. They're, they think they own the road. Like I said, it's a beautiful place. But right here is disc golf. People out right here throwing their disc on this disc golf course, very popular. Here we are at Swampy's. The best barbecue in the city. We got this massive barbecue. Wow, it feels good to stay warm right here. He's got this thing. Best barbecue in town right here Swampies that is some smoker all right everyone it's time to wrap up this video
Showed you a few things I like around the Tri-Cities. This, of course, is the off-street uh, biking, hiking path. And I'm here near Clover Island, but it is just a wonderful asset to this community. And I really enjoy coming down here, riding my bike and, uh, and stuff. So hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.